welcome to my crazy life. It's Lori. And I'm trying to get all my air fresheners out of the way. I have a Trader Joe's haul for him. I try to get a vlog started here. So I went to Trader Joe's. I'm over this way working today, so I thought I would stop. We're gonna switch from one bag to the other. I spent $29 and I will show you what I got. So I grabbed two bags of these. These are Super CD Cheese Snack Bites. They are very good. Um, they have about five carbs per seven pieces, but they're filling. I don't usually eat seven, but they're just a nice little cracker. Cracker. Um, they're good when I want something like with salami or meat. It's hot. Let me tell you, it is 90 degrees outside. I'm trying to find which drink I'm working on. Okay. Then uh, I decided I needed some more veg in my life. So I got just some um, rainbow carrots to have. Um, I would just eat them raw. I like a carrot. I don't eat too many because there's a lot of natural sugar, but I eat carrots. Oh, I got some nutritional yeast. I've been seeing on the TikTok people making what tastes like queso with nutritional yeast and cottage cheese, I think, blended. So we're going to try it. So I got some nutritional yeast, which I've not tried before. Ooh, look at these little tiny lettuce. And they say that this is a little gem. And it's like a mix between a romaine and a butter. But you get three small heads, and this is perfect for me because I don't eat a ton of salad. Not because I don't like it, but I just don't eat it fast enough. Look at this. I'm getting my hair cut Sunday. And I think, oh, and then I grabbed this. If you like a little bit of kick to things, this is crunchy chili onion oil. It's spicy, but you just use a little bit. But in the bottom, all that is red pepper flakes, dehydrated onion, and it stays crunchy. So what I like to do is stir it up, and then I will leave it on my counter upside down. But you get chili oil to drizzle, and then there's some crunchy, chunky stuff. It's pretty good. It has, you should tell me what's in it, olive oil, dried onions, dried garlic, dried red bell peppers, crushed chili peppers, toasted dried onions, sea salt, natural flavors, paprika for color. So yeah, I like it. I like it. Then I got some fruit. Um, I don't eat a ton of fruit um, just because it's got a lot of sugar, but I got some golden berries. I love them. I think I've had them on here before, but I'll tell you what they taste like. They're sweet. And then you almost get a little tomato, like a raw tomato tinge, and then it goes back to sweet. It's very interesting. Tangy tropical sweet golden berries, um, which I'll have for a snack. And then for my lunches, I got, these are apriums, part apricot, part plum, but they're nice and small. So for like an afternoon, I can show you, for an afternoon snack at work, it's just enough fruit for me. And I get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, you get eight, and it was like $4. So I always figure for me, since I cannot have a lot of fruit, I can get interesting. So that is everything I purchased at Trader Joe's. I'm debating if I need to run to Costco or if I should just wait till this weekend, which I'll probably wait till this weekend because I have some stuff from Kohl's I will show you when I get the moments on my doorstep. So let's go home. All right, I'm home and I have my Kohl's order. I did some shopping for their end of season, like super clearance. So everything was marked down and then half off of that. Um, I have a couple other things I got, but this is what came in the mail today. So I got a new purse, and this is Draper James. I think it's Reese Witherspoon's um, business. 
sorry. I'm trying to get the paper and stuff out. I should have done this before. Oh, I need to keep this for my charcoal grill. Oh my gosh, I like it, guys. So it's a little, just like a little summer bag. This is almost like a wicker. Obviously the plastic comes off of here. But there's, so there's handles. Ooh, sorry. There's handles for it, but there's also a strap. And I love me some gingham. So, and it's a nice big size purse. You just drawstring it. I like this. It's a keeper. I always get a little weirded out ordering stuff like purses, cause you never know, but it was such a good deal that I couldn't help but try. Plus I can return it if it's not the right size. Let me put this in the trash. Oh, and it's a nice long strap which I like. So we'll be wearing that. I wear a lot of navy. And then I picked up, I tried this smaller size on in store and it didn't quite work. This is Eddie Bauer, I think. Let's see. Is it? Yes, it's an Eddie Bauer dress, like fitness dress or casual. Oh, look at the pockets. I tried on the extra large and it was a little tight. This may not work either, but we'll try. I definitely will have to wear like a tank top or something under it. But just for running around, and in the summertime, I love a good dress. So I got that, I'm hoping it works. If not, like I said, I can take it right back to Kohl's, which is two minutes from my house. I just have to get the packing slip make sure and then this dress I hope it fits is a Draper James as well I really like her stuff <gasps> guys oh I need this I hope it works it's a tank dress but it's not even see oh and it has a slip under it which is perfect and it has elastic here and then a fake little belt but look at the pattern. I love it. And I hope it works. I can try it on for you. Oh, let's shut the trash. All right, if I come back and show you what it looks like, that means it fits. And I'll try on the other one too. So maybe I'll be back. Okay guys, I like it. I have to go back here to show you. I got a tag still on it. I think it's adorable. It's definitely long enough. I can wear it with some navy sandals with this. I'm dying. And it was like $20 because it was, it's a little big here, but it's okay. Most stuff is a little big there for me. I love it. And the texture, it's definitely, like an embroidered, so there's a texture to it. Hi, Dubs. Oh, and there's pockets. And a slip. Guys, I love it. I'm wearing it to work tomorrow. So this one fits, let's try on the other one. I don't hate this, I don't know that I love it. It's a little here. Um, I'll definitely either have to wear something under it like a sports bra or something or tack it. I just don't like things quite that plungy, but I think it's adorable. It's so comfortable. Like out running errands on a Saturday morning, perfect. And in the fall, I could just throw a cardigan over it. I'll keep it because it was super cheap, but I like it. But we gotta fix, fix the girls. I'll just probably, uh, most likely what I will do you just put a little tack right here, like a little stitchy stitch, but it also has pockets. Pockets, pockets, pockets. All right, guys, that is everything I got in from Kohl's today. Now I gotta get into my after work clothing. Hi, baby. Oh, man says hello. What do you need, huh? What do you need? I know what he wants. He wants his cheats. All right. 
I'm gonna get him some treats and his medicine and yeah, I'll be back. All right guys, I just got back from Costco. I was gonna make a video in there for you, but it was busy on a Tuesday. I'm not sure where all these people came from. I am on an off day from work, so I assumed it would be empty, but it was not. Anyway, I'll show you what I bought. I found something new. Pork rinds, white cheddar. I've been dreaming that somebody would come out with a pork rind with a cheese, like cheddar popcorn, cheddar pork rinds. So I grabbed a couple of these for lunch. I did try them on the way home and they're delicious. Um, so that was a new find and then they were like $5.99, which is not a bad price for a seven ounce bag. That's not bad. I think I saw a cat come in here. Um, I bought these when they have um, keto snack mix. This is perfect for me for travel, for around the house. It has um, pecans, Brazil nuts, hazelnuts, macadamia nuts, and little cheese, uh, dried cheese. It's great, I love it. So I grabbed two bags, it was $12.99 each, but they're big and they last me. So I got those. Um, I picked this up for some cereal. It's not terrible, to be honest with you. There's zero added sugar. There are 14 carbs, but there's 11 protein. I typically just snack on it dry, to be honest with you, when I want something kind of crunchy. Um, I grabbed a double, I get a two pack. This is a Kirkland brand peanut butter, and it's literally just ground peanuts. I don't even think there's salt in here. Um, oh, this peanut butter was produced in a factory that touches peanut. Yeah, it's just dry roasted peanuts and sea salt. There's no sugar, just natural. Um, I will tell you, it's very loose, like it's oily. So what I do is I store it like this, upside down. And then when I'm ready to open the container, I take my hand mixer with one beater and I whip it up and then I stick it in the fridge and it keeps it from separating. Um, this is a new find at my store. I bought these before at Trader Joe's. A two pack is $4 at Trader Joe's. This is a one, two, so four sandwiches at Trader Joe's. So two sandwiches, four slices. And this is one, two, three, four, five, six, eight, 16 slices for $6.99. So yeah, I bought them. I need to see how long they're gonna be good for in the fridge and if I need to freeze them. Um, hi, Alex. It's just cauliflower, egg whites, Parmesan cheese, and nutritional yeast. Nine grams of protein, two net carb. I don't net my carbs, so whole carbs are three. And you can toaster them, air fry. Um, I don't know if I can freeze them, but we'll see but they go in the refrigerator. That I do know. So I picked those up and then I have football starting back up and I like a little sweet treat. So I grabbed this, I don't remember how much this was, maybe 10, $12. You get nine peanut butter and nine chocolate almond and they're just little, little and they're small little bars. So I grabbed that. That was pretty much it. I went for uh, the high low chips which are almond flour potato chips or corn chips. But they only have the chili lime. And that's, it's very spicy and I don't, I, for me it's spicy, I don't like them. So I didn't get those, but I got, I'm making Taco Tuesday, so I got these instead, which yeah, I opened them on the way home. So I have that and stay tuned because I have a little bit of footage from inside Costco with a couple things and then some of Alex on a leash. I took him outside one time. We're not going to do that again because he drives me nuts for like a week. He just wanted out all the time, which I kind of knew that would happen. So we're not doing that again. But anywho, so I hope you have a good one and I will talk with you later. Bye. Guys, I'm at Costco. I need somebody to explain this to me. Whoa. It's Christmas.
I wonder what my condo board would think of those in my front yard. I love it. I love Christmas. I love gift tags. Oh, and look at the ribbons. Oh, Alex. Is you outside? Are you outside? Yeah. Where are you going? Yeah, what you doing? Why don't you go back on the patio?